the love languages don't work. The love languages are a complete myth. Uh, there's lots of studies that have shown that. You can do a Google search for it, but the love languages don't work because what, what happens is it becomes covert contracts. It becomes bribes for sex. You're, you're basically trying to negotiate genuine desire and you can't negotiate genuine desire. So as a man, there's things that you can do to increase your sexual market value because what happens is if your girl's not banging you anymore, your sexual market value, like her, your perceived sexual market value to her has, has declined. So you got to get back to the guy that she used to want to enthusiastically bang. That means you got to work on yourself. A lot of guys are trying to change their wife. You can't change your wife. You can only change yourself, okay? You can't control what she does. You can only control your actions and how you respond to things and what you're going to do about it. So what are you going to fucking do about it? You're just going to lay down and die and be like, okay, well, the relationship's over. I'm just going to find another girlfriend. You're going to have the same problems in your next relationship. Let's end that cycle right now. Let's fix it right now. Get on a call with me, okay? Free 30 minutes. I'll give you some clarity on what's going on in your relationship. and then. I'll either give you some ideas on how we can fix this or I'll steer you in the right direction, okay? There's there's a, a, there's a no-lose. It's, it's a win-win if you give me a call, okay? So go to call.fixdeadbedrooms.com. The link's in the description. All right. Womanese. So this is the, the last one we're going to go through, and this is fun. So we're going to talk about uh, womanese and then more womanese. <laughs> All right, it's no surprise that woman that I, I don't know why it's like he there's misspellings here. He means women, but it says woman. There it is it's no surprise that women speak another language. They are subtle creatures, sneaky, devious, and say things in code. It's time for men to break the code of womanese. For your reading pleasure, bold will be the woman Normal text will be the explanation. Italics will be what the book man is saying. So you can't say that. So I'll have to call that out. Okay. So the first one is the woman. I'm not looking for a relationship right now. Translate it. I don't want a relationship with you. Don't even bother trying to go out with me since I am saying that a relationship with you and me is already not going to happen. Got it? <laughs> That's where in the space we say, just add with you on the end of that, okay? So Pookman says, I was nearby when a woman was giving this veiled rejection to a coworker. I jumped in. So if you're not looking for a relationship, then all you're looking for is sex. Is that it? Her mouth dropped, but I continued. I don't believe you women. That's the only thing you have on your minds is sex, sex, and more sex. I am looking for a loving relationship, but no. You women only want passionate, raw animal sex. Now with me, I find you, uh, now with me, I find you need to taste the other pleasures in life so you can get the mind off sex, right? Her eyes were glowing or glowing at me. Funny, she suddenly wanted a relationship with me. Ha. So the woman says, I don't think of you in that way. Have, have, have you ever heard that? Have, have, have any of you heard that? There's a bunch of guys watching right now, but you guys are really quiet in the chat right now. Have any of you ever heard this? I don't think of you in that way. Let me know, like just drop a thumbs up or something in the chat if you've heard any of these. I don't think of you in that way. What she really means is, my goodness, you are ugly and a sexual dud. <laughs> she says, I think of you as a brother or you remind me of my brother. Oh, have you heard that one? She, she means I would consider sex with you to be incest. The kids were bad today. The kids were bad today. This is what she says. And then she, what she really means is, obviously, your genes are defective. <laughs> so if she's talking to her husband and you guys have kids together and she says, the kids were bad today and she's mad at you about it, it's because she thinks it's your genes and the kids that are causing the problem, you see. When she says, we were both wrong, okay, look, we were both wrong. What she really means is, but you were more wrong. <laughs> uh, these are my favorite chapters. New episodes every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Subscribe now.